Good morning, dear brothers and sisters. I am so happy to greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. This day is a very special day, the Resurrection Day. All Christianity are happy today and they celebrate the raising of Jesus from the dead. We from Romania, your brothers and sisters, Bethel Church from Hatsik and uh, your friends and brothers and sisters from South part of Romania, all of them are keeping you in their prayers and they greet you, they wish to you to keep healthy and to be protected by God in this very hard time. We are so happy to be in connection with you in this way and we are so sorry we can't be together and it's hard for you to fulfill your plans for this summer to come in Romania but we hope this will have an end and we will have possibility again to be together to meet each other and to continue our work what God gave to us receive our love our prayers and our greetings in the name of our Lord and Savior, resurrected Savior, Jesus Christ. Happy Easter, dear brothers and sisters. We are here and you are there. And our love to you, it's love of God. Please pray for us and please, uh, we are praying for us, for you. Thank you very much for your support of us. Thank you very much, and God bless you, and happy Easter. God bless you. Thank you very much again. Keep in God's love, and may have His hand of protection over us. May God bless you all. Hi, Hi friends from hi. Grace and Truth community, um, and hi, John, Lance, and Elvin, and, Meredith. and families. <laughs> Uh, we are greeting you from Romania. We are Tina and Florin, and we are so glad to be able to greet you in the precious name of Jesus Christ. Uh, as you already know, we are living in this pandemic, in this crisis, and we never know uh, when it, this is going to end. We are not allowed to go to church or uh, go outside, go to a walk. We are blessed to have a, a courtyard where the kids are, are able to play. So many people don't have this and they have to stay in their own flats. And this is really hard. I think you already understand this. And um, I think God is it's using this. I'm not saying that this is coming from God, but He is using this to uh, come closer to us, uh, to make us pay more attention to our families. And uh, this is what I want to take from this crisis. So uh, let me bless you with um, words straight from the Word of God. May God bless you and keep you, make His face shine always upon you. So may the Lord be your light and your strength your strength and your salvation. May his favor be upon you and let his presence go before you. Let his presence shine through you and um, let truth and peace abide in you, especially in this season. Nice words. I almost forgot my ideas. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, probably you know this question. So many people are asking us uh, this question this time, where's God in this crisis? Uh, there's a bigger question, where's God in the suffering that we are going through? And actually you are um, celebrating Easter this uh, the Sunday and I think this is the most beautiful and most profound answer that God is giving us to this question. He is suffering for us. Our most deep suffering is uh, our sin and he died for our sins if in order for us to be free so uh, that's why we are happy not because of the crisis not because of the pandemic we are free and happy because he died and he resurrected and that's why um, 
we think that uh, this is probably the most uh, beautiful declaration of love from God to us. So Christ is risen indeed. May God bless you. Bless you.